just not gone. What a play. Whew. Welcome to another side trip. So this channel, it's all about getting away from the grind. The daily grind. Thank you. So we might be smack bang in the centre of the West Midlands. Uh, but that's no saying that you can get sidetracked in an instant. I'm about two minutes from home and I'm on the beautiful West Midlands Canal Network. Uh, where we're going to go and have another little adventure. See what we can find. Maybe get the drone up. Uh, and find somewhere for a little chill. Uh, I'll pick this up in a bit. Oh no. So there's been a recent change in the channel. Uh, a change in job for me. I, mean, I couldn't do as many videos as I wanted. Uh, but now uh, I can find some time now to get back to the camera. I mean, at the end of the day, time's just a construct. It's a construct in the mind. And we choose what we do with it. I could choose to spend the day cleaning the house. I could choose to spend the day doing a few chores I've been putting off forever. Or I could choose to be out here. Hey. See now, don't get me wrong. I'm all for a bit of magnet fishing. Uh, a lot of the guys really respectful, pulling stuff out of the water, uh, taking it to the tip, scrapping it. Um, but when I see things like that guy just chucking it back in, because uh, it's obviously not fines that he wants, nothing worse, he's moving it from the centre of the canal to the edges of the canal, where it might affect the wildlife more. Um, so yeah, not cool, man, not cool. I was going to stop and talk to the dude, but uh, I figured with the camera he might be a little sus that I was seeing what he was doing. And there are some really good magnet fishers. Uh, they do a lot of cleaning up of the canals, keeping it tidy, even removing explosives, uh, which could pose a danger to children or anybody, boaters. So anyway, hats off to those guys. Sorry, I just don't want to go over the ducks. <laughs> good day, good day. <laughs> Thank you. concept of the channel was every time we went somewhere we found we were quite easily distracted while people were looking at the main attraction we'd be more likely to be slipping off through the woods probably because we've spotted some building or structure half falling down we end up getting a bit sidetracked main action going on there Might even be an interesting spot for the drone. So yeah. Just thinking this looks uh, quite an interesting spot to get the drone out. Have a little look around. So 
slap bang in the middle of some heavy industrial. And that's what we're going to have a look at today. Take to the sky, see what's either side, and uh, hopefully have a good flight. We'll pick this back up when she's in the air. So checking the drone flight risk app, and uh, we seem all good to go here. No restrictions in the area. We've done all the pre-flight checks. We'll wait for a bit of connection here and we'll take her up for a quick squeeze and see what we can see. This is the DJI Mavic 3 Pro. I've been using it for a, a little while now. I'm enjoying it. And there we are on the screen. If you can see that. We'll start the record. And we'll take her off. Let's go watch some of these trees around here. There you go. She's successfully up in the air. Here we are. The screen. This side where we are, and there I am. Get a bit of height thirty five, forty two. We'll take her up to about fifty meters. There we go, fifty one meters. Nice and high there. Get a good all round. Try and raise the gimbal a touch. See what we can see. We have a scrap yard on that side. Oh, looks like he's stopped with the uh, the big crane moving now. Doing a break with that one. No. Uh, no movement now, we just missed that. And then lorries in there. to uh, the Wolverhampton over in this direction, there we go, you can see off into the distance, as I watch that go, there we go, beautiful, and as we come back around, look down, and back at the scrapyard, there's still little's going on really.
I was park. There's some water down there as well. Okay. We can check the park out. Maybe see if we can find a spot. Get ourselves a broom. Owls Park. Hopefully not dog followers park. It's got a little water feature. How beautiful. More than just the pond. Beautiful lilies on there. You can see them. And the S environmental. Does look a good spot. And it seems as good a spot as any. Coming up behind me. Up behind you. Doesn't look that way. Not down to the next bridge anyway. Amazing things, aren't they? Seen a lot of days. Jesus. Proper shovel and shit. Yeah, so we got a cat moving. But the way some of them walls have been it, I think it used to be a learning centre for them. Okay, not the cleanest of places around here. 
shit to pick it up. Oh, buddy. I think he was a little worried. His mate doesn't seem to mind. Cycle down, take a bit more look at this yard. No signage on the place to say what it is. Certainly a lot of shit here. Like waste plaster, wood. Seems to have some leaking water. Where's that coming from? A bit wasteful in the hose pipe van. Seems to be coming out of the wall. Yeah, it'd be interesting to see what this place is. Definitely not very good there. Interesting little place. That doorway over there. Well, used to be a doorway over there. I don't think it is anymore. Yeah. Well, I'll pick this back up if we get any interest. I'll just stay here a minute. See what's occurring. Vehicle and contents left here entirely at owner's own risk. Nice area then. High visibility jackets must be worn. Protective footwear must be worn. No admittance, unauthorised personnel, and that'll be us. We ain't allowed in. But we can film what we can see from the public vantage point. That's one mile of a messy yard. What a job, man. Picking through the shit, dividing the shit from the shit, finding more shit, moving shit, shoveling shit. Even got a 938k cap shoveling shit. And the result? The yards are shit all. ECL is the name on the jacket, ECL. And just seems a shit all of the yard. Yeah. They're happy leaving me to it, and I'm happy leaving them to it. Hello, Caravancini. <laughs>